oh yeah, I guess what time it is. It's time for Destiny 2. Um, I've already seen that Bungie have uploaded a video on YouTube. Uh, I'm not going to spoil what that video was, but if it's correct, then uh, we're going to see something now when we go into Destiny here. So, yeah. Uh, I did, um, I have it updated, so we're going to go in and we're going to have a look at it. And yes, a lot of things have happened to my model since, like, I've last streamed Destiny. Like, for fuck's sake, I have cat ears now. <laughs> we're back to the cat ear phase once again. But this is, like, I think the first time Josie has had cat ears. Like, Jonesy has had them many times, but now, like, Josie has to don them on for 14-odd days or so. Today, like, I switched to this model, and all the other goals were hit with them. I was like, yeah, just seven days. But then it's like, anything outside of that is like, okay, they're 14 days, fine. I give up. So the cat, here, eh, cat ears and all that will follow into the... Well, not 14 days, 14 streams, sorry. But the model won't be here forever. Returning Eververse items. Some of the most popular items from our 30th anniversary celebration are returning through the uh, through the end of season uh, 19. Check them out now on the Eververse store page. If they sell the uh, Energy Sword finisher, I swear if they sell the Energy Sword finisher like for Bright Dust now, I'm going to cry. Because I got that ages ago for, like I think, silver because I just had silver left over. Cutscene question mark? Or is it just going to... Take me to orbit first. Okay, yeah, no, there's something here. Let me. Oh, we're in the helm. Hold on. Let me also mute the music real quick. And then turn up the in game sound. Find Anna Rasputin. You are being summoned to an urgent briefing. Seek out Anna and Rasputin. Rasputin, you can't be serious. We have no other options. Aramis has breached the Warsap Network security protocols. Soon our most dangerous weapon will be in our enemy's hands. Once she issues the command to fire, not even I will be able to stop it. Our only choice will be to destroy the Warsap. All of them. The only way to do that is... Yes. Once I am uploaded to the orbital station, oh, man. I my self-destruct sequence. No! There must be another way! I have run trillions of combat simulations. They all end with the same result. My mere existence places humanity in danger. All that I am, every protocol, every line of code, must be erased forever. I must die. So others may live. I won't let you sacrifice yourself. I know. Clovis built me to be a weapon. To destroy my designated targets. But you... You taught me to be something more. A shield. A protector. A guardian. He gave me form. He gave me function. But you gave me purpose. Please help me fulfill that purpose now. Let me save humanity. I just got you back. Now I have to say goodbye. I've always been with you, Anna. And I always will be. Yeah, damn, I, don't, I, don't, I think people are predicting this is probably going to happen, because it's like, what else can we do with, like, Rasputin at this point? Like, he's too, he's literally the overpowered character that needs to be written out of the story. But it's just such a shame that this is happening twice now. For Basically, the first time during Season of the Worthy or something, or, like, Season of the Arrivals, and now again with, like, Season, um, the thing now, Season of the Seraph, like... We have no time to waste. Aramis has access to Horant Imperative, the protocol I created to... ...to use the Warsats against the Traveler and prevent its departure. I surmise that the Traveler is Aramis's target as well. My internal algorithm has repaired me to the point where my self-destruct sequence can be initiated once I am uploaded to the network. However, 
Aramis has discovered and sealed the back door we installed aboard the station. You must manually link me to the controls. Breach Sarah's station with the pillory Engram in hand. The time for subterfuge is over. Haste is what matters now. If Aramis fires the war sex, the resulting devastation will be incalculable. There may be nothing left for the hive to conquer. We cannot allow that to happen, Guardian. You must do what is necessary to prevent it. And so must I. Damn. I, and also people are predicting as well. If you don't want to know, then just tune out now. But like, people are predicting then he's going to be like rezzed as a guardian again. And like basically as Felwinter once was. Which would be a funny turn of events, honestly. And then all of a sudden it's like, oh wait, he, he's still Rasputin, right? So he still has link to his stuff, right? We've no time to waste, Rasputin says, for C. I'm just planning succeed a plan, obvious catastrophe. It's remote access being disabled, the forms you complete, there's no time to waste. So, matchmaking off, the activity has a fixed power level, legend difficulty, heavily shielded and highly aggressive combatants appear in great numbers. Abhorrent imperative prevented. So Ascendant Shared and Spirit of the War Mind. So, but I mean, if the ship is named Spirit of the War Mind, that means we obviously succeed, like. Which is kind of depressing when you think about that. I know I'm. D oh. oh, the mission is over there, okay. Oh, it's. I was gonna say, I was gonna go to the other side of the uh, helm just to see if I could get into here, but I guess not. I guess they are pigeonholing me into this. Final Dawn. Pella was capped for his activity. Expect a challenge. I mean, once we go in, we can have a look at, like, how difficult it actually is. But, I mean, if it's saying it's tough, then I'm all for it. Then I might have to actually swap this on real quick. I know I have that on, but <laughs> we could put on the RGB, yeah. Well, it's not RGB, but I, did, I think I changed the shader on this. This is like the one piece of taking gear that can actually be changed. And I put this one on the uh, sinking feeling. Such a good shader to put on it. So cool, like. We only get one shot at this. It's all on us. House Salvation has locked down the launch facility and we don't have time to regain control. Rasputin is going to try to remotely scramble the station's defenses. Buy you a couple of seconds to do a flyby and transmat in. Emphasis, a couple of seconds. Brace yourself. Are we sacrificing my ship then? <laughs> what are we up to? Oh, the music though. The load in music just to, for that. Oh! Salvation on high alert. They'll throw everything they have at you. Empress Keitel is scrambling Imperial warships to divert the fleet's attention. Get to the command center so we can start the upload. I'm actually kind of glad it starts in a different point of the mission as well. Hi, Vandal. Event rank is Sky Shock and context is Hades. Hurry. How are they. How are they shooting me like that? Oh god. Well, okay. We have failed, guys. We, we have failed to prevent humanity's downfall. Imagine if it just says that. It just Everything just blows up. It's like, you'll be restarting soon. Oh, come on. Why is the revive so far away? Rasputin route bypass initiated. Oh, so as I go along the mission, it's going to... Different areas are called different things, based on thing. Regenerating encryption keys. I'm probably going to... Oh, God. Oh. I seriously need to look at where I'm going, man. I <laughs> just like I'm too busy just reading at the side, like. But I can't help it though. They've used it once during um, what was it, season of the splicer? It's such a good way to tell the story as it goes along. If you don't think of it as location names, because if I were to go backwards, the text would also like indicate that too. Oh my god. Watch him actually- oh god. Watch him actually drop war sats on us. And watch me be the, like, slowest runner to get to the end as, like, slow as possible. Nah, I seriously don't know what's up with it. <laughs> I can't even use the excuse it's been a while since i played the game, because I've been basically playing it every day trying to get different red border frames. Okay, one. 
two, three, four, five. Ah, uh, they hit, but they don't hit hard enough. Oh, Aramis! I was just like, wait, I recognize that, like, pose anywhere. It kind of makes sense that we're facing her again, I guess. Why is she not shooting me? She's just freezing me. Or trying to. I should have probably done this first, wait. I, I, <clears throat> as I was saying, I probably should have done this first. And then weakened her. Are you trying to get up by me? Like, what? Uh oh. Thank you for invisibility. Sorry, sorry, Aramis. Can you just uh, move out of the way there? Thank you. I love the way she's actually like tall again, not like in the cutscene from Season of the Plunder. Is she healing by any chance, or am I just doing so little damage because I literally have this going on? Oh, I literally... <laughs> Good job, Joe. Th this is all I have left. Be easy with me. This is going to take a while. Oh my god, it loads so slow as well. Actually, to be fair, I could just use this over and over. I just see my, like, grenade launcher more as, like, a weakening weapon rather than using it as a thingy weapon. Okay, I have a shield. Let me just throw that at you real quick. Oh, ah. Uh. This was it. This was your final resistance. I expected more. What do you mean you expected more? I'm still, like... What vengeance for Reese? The Guardians didn't do anything! Now, what is Aramis, like, chatting on about? I literally did not do anything to Reese. I do not remember, anyway. Oh my god. If my aim was a bit better, we'd be through this by now. There we go. If only if I didn't, like, change my gun partway through. And I just used the heavy ammo as I had it. That'd be nice. Oh my god. And I- how did I miss that? Down, 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 down. Oh my god, I was literally spamming the super button and I just- mm. I couldn't do it because I was in the middle of the finisher. How far back am I going? Please tell me I've at least got Aramis to fight or something. Yeah, okay. Th this is grand. This is grand. It's not that far back. But it is annoying having to kill everything again. Dude, just keep punching everything, Joe. You'll be good. Trust. God, this servitor, though. Okay, okay, maybe if I aim, that'd be nice. Oh, 
Okay, not gonna lie, they are actually, like, <laughs> destroying me. I'm assuming when I take out everything, I'll actually be able to continue. Because imagine if I could leave, like, five seconds ago, and I'm like, oh, I'm still here. Oh, heavy frames? Are these the frames I'm thinking they are? Oh, yup! We got these boys back. I haven't seen these guys since Season of the World, are they? Look how cool they are, man. Sir, excuse me, come through. I'm trying to stop Aramis from destroying everything, that'd be nice. Oh, <laughs> there's actual just stasis crystals everywhere. I wonder who is here. I mean, I could just shoot the crystals, but okay. I, I guess that's cool. It's <laughs> just like the departure compromise, human survival, and the epoch. Oh, and if you notice that symbol as well before that, what it said here. Hold on. Oh, never mind. It's gone now. So never mind. It isn't what I thought it was like. But the um, traveler symbol for what Rasputin calls it is there. Sorry, excuse me. Come true. Sorry, gentlemen, coming through. Don't mind me. Aramis has the worst at firing system at 75%. We're running out of time. Leave the resistance and engage the pillory and run to the main console. You know, wouldn't it be low key kind of funny if we actually failed? Wait, where am I taking this? It just says 75% on the thing, but I don't actually know where I'm going. Oh god. Really? That hit no one? The chances of that, man. I miss when I used to be able to use two supers, like, or choose between two supers on the fly. Titans had such versatility in the void super. But I do understand why they got rid of it, though. Because then at that point, it's like, okay, why can't, like, well users do Dawnblade instead of well all the time, you know? And why can't hunters just, like, exist? Here? It's a weird spot. Uh, oh, it, it, now it's giving me the option. There we go. No, no, no. Oh, it's this one. I thought it was just Aramis. I'm like, wait, what? Why into Aramis? Scourge of Earth. That, that sounds like a big bad, not gonna lie. Oh, wait, hold on. Wait, hold on, get, just, just come. Where are you running away? Have you seen the size of me compared to you? Oh, yeah, don't take the engram. It, it, it's, not, it's not a good engram. You're, you're not gonna get much from it. Oh my god, what? Man. Okay, what did that do? Did that just spawn the boss again? Yeah, it spawned the boss.
I don't know what did so much damage to me there, but I, I ain't trusting it. Ignore that grenade. That definitely hit the boss, you know? This boss is too smart. I hate it. <laughs> it's just like, oh yeah, I'm gonna just like, you know, use my ability in your like bubble so you can't use it. There we go. It's gone again, I think. Yeah. I love the way it just transmats out as if it's like a guardian. Oh my god. Oh my god, I almost killed myself! And I killed myself. Well, to be fair, that was the... I didn't know the boss was still roaming. And then I saw the trap, I was like, well, I guess I'm screwed. Can I eat this before, like we said? Mm-hmm. Indeed you can. Ah. Oh. Thank you. As this side. Oh, never mind. It's this side. Oh, yeah, I was thinking about the second phase. That's what I was thinking of. I didn't know how far that was going to blow me, so I was like, nah, I'm not risking that. Oh god. That maybe running is a good option, Joe. It's okay to hide back a bit. It's not okay to die two times in a row. Oh my god, no. Please, I'm, get, I'm begging, please. Don't do this to me. Oh my god. Come on. Why did I think staying still was a good idea? I thought, you know what? Let's go invisible. That'll help me. And actually, let me just turn it down a tiny bit. I'll also have the chance. And then take a swig of water. I'll get this done eventually, swear. If we're gonna go whole hog, I require you and you. Actually, I should. Mm. I just realized now I probably should have actually swapped thing. Doesn't matter. Maybe even got anarchy on. Right, hold on, let me... Is that not enough? Hold on. Ow! Ow! <gasps> Bro! I was literally about to super! They just know when I'm about to super, like. Am I... Am I getting bodied so easily because I'm in the air or something? Is the airborne effective or, or airborne effectiveness? What mods are on? Hmm. Ah, no. Nah. Okay, you know what? I mm, no. Yeah, no. Screw. It. I okay. No, I'll, I'll <laughs> genuinely I'll concentrate this time. Swear. I'm just being too aggressive.
How did I miss that rocket? I'm actually so disappointed in myself for missing that rocket. Sorry, bud. I require you for shield or not shields, for invisibility. Same with you. I think I missed the shot, but you know what? It is how it is. You're not gonna always hit a banger, you know? Or have a banger. I wonder if this has. I don't even know if this has Vorpal on. I just kinda chucked it on hoping it did have Vorpal. No, it has Chain. Okay, it's more useful than against you guys. Ow! You love using that attack, don't you? Ow. I just hide the back to back. Okay, I need to actually go around and get more ammo. Ow! Joe, get out of it as soon as you can. That thing hurts, like, trust. Yeah, you're conjuring up this, Joe. Wait, what now? What's happening? Oh, yeah, it's the other one. That just took a while. I was like, wait, what, what am I on again? Can't remember. Oh, they're just snipers. Okay, Ooh, get down in here. Sorry, excuse me. Coming through, coming up. Whew. Fella threw that at me and I didn't even know where I was like. Oh, it was the virus going up like the whole time and I just never know it was that as well. <laughs> See, this is now why I wonder why I die so fast. Literally shooting rockets like right in its face from two meters away. Okay, hold on, let me get the sniper first. No, never mind, the sniper's pussing out. There we go. Why do I think that's a good idea? That is not a good idea. That is the worst idea. Oh my god. Oh, float. Float to avoid the main damage. Damn. Literally, like, the boss just took my advice there. Just float to get away from main damage. Oh, it's done. Wait, I didn't even get to defeat the boss. Oh. I don't feel anything. Why is it leaving? Yes. No way is the traveler gonna bounce on us now. Could you imagine if the fucking traveler actually left after we just shut down the systems to trap it here? Oh shit, we actually got a.
I have a new cutscene in the Witch, uh, Witch Queen style. Oh, no, yeah, I, oh, it's gone. Uh. Oh, we are so fucked. Oh, we are dead. If the traveler's bouncing, you know we're fucked. We're done. And we just shut down the weapons to stop it from going. Oh, no. I don't, I don't think getting any higher is going to do anything. Oh, this is so weird. It's leaving. The traveler is leaving. I mean, multiple times we were told this in the lore. We've already done it, haven't we? Aramis, please do not do this. If you oh, wow. People, if she doesn't care. She's... Oh. Oh, she sees the witness. Oh, is it not leaving now? It's just like, oh yeah, there's no danger. I guess I'm coming back now. <laughs> it's just like, imagine. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, no way. Bro, that's fucking homage to like the original Destiny 1 cover. Fuck, man. Honestly, I'm not gonna lie. I almost kind of teared up there part way through. The fucking music is just... It was so beautiful in that moment. And, like, actually getting to see, like, or have the feeling that the Traveler was gonna just <laughs> say goodbye, like, bro. Ah. Because, like, in all the Lightfall promotion, there's nothing about, like, the Traveler itself, I don't think. It's mainly just, like, well, there's that little bit about the Traveler, but, like... It doesn't show, like... Actually, no, it might have shown Earth. I can't fully remember, though. But, like... I don't think it was obvious if the Traveler left or not. Which, if they did keep that a secret until now... Is such a good plot point. I wonder if the Traveler's just gonna stay up there, or if it's just... Or if it was readying itself, like, putting itself in a different position. Oh, that music, though, it's all a bit different. I mean, I can't do the Crypt Dark Dow when I'm listening to this music and going to Zavala, like. Oh, yeah, shit, I just realized. Oh, that's so cool. Can, where is the Traveler? Wait, did it actually? No, it said it didn't flee. And they saw it in the cutscene. Where is it? Is it, like, right above my head and I just can't see it? 
so interesting. I am at your service. Damn, couldn't even get Savala to do a line. Savala's gaze is transfixed on the empty space where the Traveler once hung in the sky. For a moment, I thought my greatest fear had become reality. That the Traveler had decided to leave us to fend for ourselves. He turns to face you, a look of tired relief in his eyes. But in that moment, I also had another thought. Gesturing broadly to the city, Savala casts his eyes upon once more. Uh, once more. The last time I saw Cabal ships in the sky over the city, I looked to the Traveler to save us. But now, Cabal, Elixni, Awoken. Our allies have rallied to us. We look to each other instead. Savala rolls his shoulders, then squares them to the challenge ahead. In the wake of Rasputin's sacrifice, the Rathborn have begun pulling back their forces, but I can't shake the feeling that they're just making way for an even greater threat. When he looks at you again, it is with steel in his eyes. Whatever the Traveler's intentions, it chose to stay with us, just as we have chosen to stand together. Damn. Even Ikora is getting a bit in on this. What am I going to do now? Visit, like, Cade's grave now? I feel like once the light and dark saga is over, we got to visit his grave, right? It'd be a shame not to. Oh, yeah, actually. Actually, not. Just run in. Because I do think it is just faster to just run straight in from the courtyard. I think I've seen, like, a video on it before. It just came up on my feed. I was like, ah, oh, you know, actually, I'm kind of curious. How long will this take? Actually, no, it might have been the other way that was shorter. Oh, wait, yeah, down here, not uh, Hawthorne. Yes, Guardian. A chorus silence. She stands facing the empty space in the sky that once held the Traveler and says nothing. A cold breeze blows across the plaza, picking up dried leaves and scraps of paper from the bazaar. The silence that has fallen over the tower is haunting. A chorus turns and exhales a long held breath. If you've come. To me, for guidance, I have none. The words have or fall heavy out of her mouth. Nothing could have prepared me for this. She looks away for a moment, not ready to cross this uh, conversational line. But then she finds her strength again. Guardian. Ikora's voice has an adamacy to it. Whatever comes next, I want you to know it has been an honour fighting alongside you. Through loss, through victory, through the haze of war between... I don't know if this is humanity's final hour, she says, looking up to the sky. But if it is, then we will face the end together. Akura looks at you, and for the first time you see something new in her eyes. Fear. Go spend time with the people you love, Akura says in quiet certainty. It may be your last chance to. Speak to Anna Bray in the helm. Damn, honestly... The fucking vibe right now is actually really, like, tense. Because it's just, like, we just lost Rasputin and we thought we were going to lose the Traveler as well. I think that's interesting, though, having it, like, not completely leave, but, like, you know, stay hovering above Earth. Because I don't, like, I think that's what they were implying, because Aramis was like, why isn't it just fleeing? Because, obviously, like, if the Traveler could travel for quite a while... Or even travel fast speeds, or travel across space in general. Like, you know, it must have that ability to do what it wants, like, and to go where it desires to get away from the struggles of the universe. That was only a legendary ship, anyway. So, wait, is Rasputin just dead? Guardian, ever think about the things we pick up? People we latch on to as if something outside of us could tell us who we are? Like polishing a rusty name tag to a fine shine. Being a Bray defined me, for better or worse. I thought Rasputin was my link to who I was, that I could rediscover myself through him. I tried that for a long time, like he was a tool. It wasn't until later I understood he'd become a person. Rasputin was family. But now, he's gone. He sacrificed himself to save us. 
Clovis would never have done that. But I taught Rasputin to make his own decisions. In the end, he defined who he was and what he did. And so can I. If I can carry on the Bray legacy, not Clovis's, but mine, I can choose what it means to be a Bray, just like Rasputin chose what it meant to be a Warmind. Goodbye, Red. For real, this time. Thank you for teaching me who I am. Who I could be. And who I want to become. Damn. A new outlook on the future as, like, we're all about to fall to shit. Receive Rasputin's final message. Sorry, boy, we still have you. That was just weird to see it limp like that. Guardian, if you are listening to this, then the deed is done. I trust my sacrifice was not in vain. I and I have shared our farewell. This will be hard on her, but she is resilient, strong, and she is not alone. I have a final message for you as well. Oh? The Neptunian city in Osiris's visions is real. I do not know its exact location, but it is home to the Veil. The Veil? An the oh, an object, power, okay. One that is linked to the Traveler. The details are contained within the Nefele stronghold files retrieved from the Cosmodrome. I have decrypted them for Osiris's benefit. Tell him. Tell him it is a parting gift. From one old miser to another. All other files referencing the city have been deleted from my records. And not by me. Oh, not by you? Someone wanted it to remain a secret. Anna once worried that she had neglected to teach me how to trust. But now, as my penultimate act, I entrust this knowledge to you. Use it well, my Seraph. Humanity has no more need of a war mind. Not when you have each other. Damn. I'm just like, that. you know, if you wonder why I stay still there for a moment, just reading over or like going over that. Or why I'm just looking at the screens because obviously I'm just making sure I've read everything. Yeah, no, I think because the ship actually, they shouldn't have given us the name of the ship yet, honestly. I think that kind of spoiled, well, obviously, I think it was obvious he was going to sacrifice himself, but still. You never know, something could have changed. Yeah, no, it's the same shader. Yeah, there you go. Put on the thingy one and then delete this one. Honestly, that, that was a nice, like, ending, I guess, to the season. And Persona. Let's see, what do we got? I'm gonna unlock the whole book now. I don't know, it, man, it is actually depressing. It's, it's like, second time in a row we try to save him and fella has to just clock out, you know? now 
for however long that is. I can't know what the future holds, Elsie. But I do know we'll face it together. I don't know what the future holds either. Not anymore. And I'll be honest, that terrifies me. That's interesting, because before, like, the Exo Stranger was a good person to go to for reference for what's happening, or what happened in the alternate timelines, and then what's happening now. It's just, like, things are different now, because, obviously, um, well, the Traveler didn't leave like it did in the Dark Future lore book. Yeah, I think that's a good place to just wrap up the stream, honestly. I don't think I'm going to stream much longer now. I'm just, I guess, just, like, looking around. I think I'll go to the tower just one more time to have a proper look at, like... Yeah, even just, like, here. Just to look out and see, like, that the Traveler is just not there anymore. Because I swear, again, in that cutscene, you could actually see the Traveler in the sky. Unless it's, like, in the new, like... If there's going to be a new one, like, when you load into Earth, you'll just see the Traveler when you load in or something like that. The Traveler needs to start making some big moves. Like, that was the first big move, but we need more of those now. And again, that, like, load-in sound when you go to the Tower now. I love that they changed it. It's just... It's just so ominous now. And I'm assuming that's where things are going from there. I think that's... That's not the Traveler, is it? That's the moon, isn't it? I think. Yeah, honestly, <laughs> if anything, this season is like, or the end now has just re reminded me that I need to uh, pre order Lightfall soon. Because, like, we're literally two weeks away now from, like, finishing this year of Destiny, which is weird to think about because for the longest time, people. Yeah, no, that's the moon because it's, like, so bright. For the longest time, um,. We look towards, like, the Witch Queen, because Savathun was mentioned in, like, I think some Taken King lore. And now that the Witch Queen has passed, it's just, everything's kind of flying by now. We have Life Fall coming up, and then we have the final shape. And obviously we have everything else that's going to be after that, too. Yeah, no, I'm still confused on where the Traveler actually is, but obviously it's not down on Earth anymore. You can't see it there, but... Because, honestly... In this scenario, right, let's say, like, Rasputin died, but also the Traveler was blown to smithereens. We'd still be able to use the light because of the, uh, light shared. We just would have to teach other people about the Traveler light shared thing. And then maybe start building a city around that instead. But yeah, that's gonna be weird. Anyway, enough of me being sappy and whatnot. This is it, this is the end of the stream. Thank you so much for watching the stream. Obviously, if you want to see more Destiny streams, um, I'll probably stream Destiny again on the 28th or 29th of February, depending on what happens then. Because I, I most likely will be streaming when, like, Life Fall comes out. But yeah, thank you again so much for watching. And, uh, yeah, goodbye.